Hey everyone, uh, welcome. We talked about this product and announced this on stream not long ago, but I wanted to take a bit of a deeper dive, a bit more of a sneak peek for you all on our channel of what the Ultimate Game Master screen looks like, what it is, what it consists of. Um, years ago, give or take COVID, I designed a and built a GM screen on our YouTube channels. One of our first tutorial videos, it exploded. And actually everything that we've done has basically almost started from that video. If it wasn't for that video kind of taking off, I don't know if we'd be here. Uh, and so thank you for the support on that. And for that, the things that lo I loved about it were first of all, that it was customizable and also that it was magnetic. And so the fact that you could stick your documents to it, but the only thing is, is the charts seemed to or, or tended to get outdated. I would learn that information. I don't need those charts. And then I have all this information on my screen and with other commercially available screens that have baked charts in them, you just never know. Um, and so I wanted a screen where the charts were interchangeable and I wanted a screen that was fully magnetic that I could customize any way that I wanted. So when Forged Gaming came to us and said, hey, Realmsmith, if you had products that you wanted to design, how can we help you design some products and release them for us? I said a GM screen is absolutely where I wanted to start and where we need to start. And so this GM screen is fully customizable. We've tried to keep the, uh, the Game Master in mind when we built it. And I'm just going to walk you through some of the uh, features of it. Of course, it is a fully um, magnetic screen. And what makes that magnetic is the fact that there's four metal panels on the inside. And then the two outer panels on the outside are metallic as well. Uh, and that just makes it magnetic because then magnets will stick to them. And it's actually that simple. Gorgeous PU leather inside and out. Uh, metal corners, custom corners. These aren't the final corners. We're actually getting uh, corners custom built for the screen that are in production right now. First off, uh, the core product. So when you uh, order this product, it's going to come with the screen itself and this cool little binding structure, which binds the outside of it when it's closed to keep it shut. It also holds the rivet magnets that come with your screen. And so there will be eight rivet magnets that come with the core product. And these are just really cool, metallic, worn, rustic rivets that just work as magnets. And so if you have maps or handwritten notes or anything, documents that you want to stick to your screen, you can just place those on and they stick no problem. And then you hold them in here. That's the core product. This also doubles as a dice tower. And so... If you were to put it either horizontal, vertically or at a slight angle, diagonally, you could roll your dice down it. That was a natural 20 I just rolled uh, with the, the dice tower. So that's what the core product comes with. That is what is included in the core product, as well as some blank charts um, that you can actually write on. That will be wet erase that you can fill in the charts with whatever information you want. Random encounter tables, DCs, anything that you want to remember we are gonna include a set of blank charts in there as well. The core of this product, as mentioned before, or the core concept is charts. And so not only will you get blank charts, but we're also planning to support all of your favorite RPGs as we start to talk to some of those companies about including charts for their games in this product or for this product. And so you'll be able to buy an upgrade for your favorite game system, and it will come with monsters and NPCs and charts. Uh, that you can place on your screen, whichever ones are pertinent to you, which makes the most sense. Uh, those charts will come with a pouch um, inside and which leads me to the pouches. These are really cool. Um, they're utility pouches. And so you can put anything in these. You can put uh, pencils or pens or anything you want in there. You can put minis or dice. They have a metal clasp on the uh, flap and they have really strong mag magnets on the outside. So when you're traveling, you can just stick them to the screen on the outside, fold it up as if it's a tome or a pack and carry it along with you. The next thing is the initiative tracker. Um, one of my favorite features, it is a magnetic initiative tracker that you can just take on and put on as you need to. You can rearrange them really quick because they're magnets. And the one side has all the information for your character uh, for your characters and then the other side for yourself. And so whether it be passive perception or whatever you need to know about the players or the characters at your table, along with their name and so on. And then of course, a little window viewing window in the back that shows the players when they're up. And so if Falfer is first, for example, he will go there, so on and so forth. And you can track initiative and everybody else can see when their turn's coming up so they can be ready. These will also come, you can take these cards out 
and you can write on them. They will be wet erase, which will be great. Um, and so you can, if you have different players, different games that you're playing, even different systems, you can trade them in and out as necessary. Uh, and they will be branded to different game systems as we release for different systems. That is the initiative tracker and the initiative tracker will come with a pouch and these fit really, really nicely inside here. And they're actually really great because because they're magnetic, they stick together as one unit and then you can just place them in your little pouch, close it up, done, initiative tracker. The next thing is the monster card holder. Um, we're still iterating on a lot of this. And let me say, folks, this is our intended release. We are still in the process of designing and creating. I'm gonna tell you about how to be involved in that at the end of this video, so stay tuned as to how you can help us continue to develop this. But this is the monster card holder. Basically, really straightforward, just like the initiative tracker, wet erase uh, cards for your favorite game systems, some blank ones that you can create your own monsters and so on that will come with it. Um, and there will be a number of them that come in a pack together. And then it's just quick reference for monsters. And then there will be areas like hit points, for example, that you can wet erase and you can change the hit points, uh, hit points as you go. And of course, magnetic again, uh, that you can stick to your thing. You can stack monsters if you do. If you're really evil, this whole side can be monsters and this little side can be your players if you want it to be. So that is the monster card holder. Finally, um, we have our, well, finally, or the next in line, I should say, is the holders. And so this is very, very simple. It's a phone holder. I never know where to put my phone when I'm GMing. I want it right there. So if, if one of the players send me a text or I get an emergency text or something, I can just glance at it without picking up my phone and having to put it back down. This is a great way to do that. It just really easily sticks. It'll even stick to the outside. Um, but, and there's some four really strong magnets in the back, a little lip and then a lip here. And there will be a hole for a charging cable when the time comes. So you just do that, place your phone on it, phone stays, you have it right there. If you use it for rules, that's great. Or for your favorite VTT or um, even World Anvil um, in order to access information. And if you're really into it, a tablet holder. And so the tablet holder again has magnets on the back. It, it sits on the table to allow support for your tablet with a little lip to keep it in place, a little incline so it stays put where it needs to. And then again, just magnetic very, very nice, stays nice and firm and fits perfectly within the environment of the screen. And you can access whatever information and run, say Sirenscape if you want to. If you have Sirenscape on the side, you could do that and DJ your game as necessary. That is the ultimate Game Master screen experience. I think I've covered it all. There's lots more to come, including looking at uh, decorative panels that we're having developed right now and designed. The te 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 uh, sorry, we are developing the technology in order to do that. Um, which is going to be great and illustrating all of the awesomeness that will be there. And we'll be launching this hopefully soon. That is the plan we want to launch when we're ready. Um, and again, this is a Forge Gaming product designed by Realmsmith and we couldn't be happier um, to partner with them in order to bring this to market. If you're interested in being a part of the development process, um, even giving feedback on designs and iterating with us and us showing you things and polls and, and you being able to vote on certain features and just helping us really refine this because we want to keep the GM or the Game Master in mind as we continue to create this and as we learn and as we move together, head to theultimategamemaster.com. Please allow us to have your email. We will take very good care of it and we will send you updates on releases and new features and all of that stuff as well as... Um, including you in a process and being included into private groups for designing the product with us. Thank you very much. Love each other. We'll see you at the table and we can't wait to bring you the ultimate game screen.